Hey guys, welcome back to my channel here. This is Pinkin Tech. Like my last video mentioned, I'm going to record a guide on how to install your PCIe Wi-Fi and Bluetooth adapter. So uh, let's start off with the magnetic base. So we have the two high gain antenna here. What you need to do is just to screw them both in first. Yep, and then uh, try to anchor your, because I'm going to put it on my case, so I'm going to stick it like so. And now you're done with this part. Next, if you want to install your Bluetooth, you need to install this Wi-Fi, uh, this wire here. If you don't need Bluetooth, then you don't have to install this. But I, since I need it, I'm going to install it. It's an added feature anyways. So why not? So, uh, yeah. First thing you gotta do is to connect this head into the white header here. So just push this in gently. Like so. And then remember, this will have to go to F. USB so uh, yeah now we need to install this into the PC so uh, I'm gonna move the camera here it's a little bit dark but I hope you can see it well let me try get some lighting here Let me just put this here, All right? So uh, you're gonna have to find the PCIe slot of this size. So mine is like at the bottom of the motherboard. It's usually at the bottom of the motherboard. So uh, yeah, so take out your PCIe slot here. That matches the slot that you want to install and then push this in so let me just move the camera a little bit closer so i'm going to install this slot you have i have a few slots but in order to ensure adequate offer to this um, adapter and also to the gpu i chose to install in this slot instead of the lower slot or the one that's very much just one cm against the GPU fan, so I figured out that this is the best slot. And then you're gonna have to use the screw, screw it in place. So then lift it out a bit so that it stays in place and then screw it in there we go alright then now what I'm going to do is to find the US USB F thing and then uh, looking at this header so you see there's a uh, there's ten, nine holes with one hole at the right, top right, um, not a hole. So you gotta find that kind of USB slot. So I'm trying to find mine here, which is the MSI motherboard. So it's a little bit hard if you have a lot of um, A lot of wire, so uh, I figure out that the connection is this one. So if I, yeah, so it should be this one. So if I match the wire, 
It's gonna be like this. So yeah. Just gonna try and start this one in here. So off we go. So I'm installing into my USB one. Sorry about the bad I think, but this is the best I can do right now. Lots of wire in place. That's really blocking the space. So yeah, okay. We gotta install. And now and now I'm going to install this to the adapter. So the first thing I'm going to do is to loosen this out a bit and then uh, just screw them in if you can see just screw them in and then uh, this one too So, and then what I'm going to do is uh, yeah. So yeah, I'm just gonna stick it on my computer and then uh, do it like this it's a bit of a mess in the back here but we'll see and then we're gonna try and put the computer back on but uh, I need to turn on the power first And I'm also going to take off my Bluetooth USB here so that I can test whether it works it on and then I'm going to put the computer Okay So for the boot So as you can see, it is still connected to the Ethernet cable because I left it on. But now what we need to do is to install the driver. So I have it downloaded beforehand, but uh, you can try and download it with the link I, I put down in the video description below. So uh, this is the driver and we have both for the Wi-Fi and the Bluetooth, so we're going to install both. Run. Next. Agree. Install. I assume it's going to ask us to restart the computer. Okay. And then the Bluetooth. Except typical install. Okay. 
all right so it's complete so let's see if we have wi-fi connection yes there is so uh i'm going to try to connect to my 5g here so uh, one. That's weird. Let me just try and connect this one first. No internet. Se it connected secure. And then uh, I'm also going to try to... Yep, Bluetooth is working. And then uh, let me just try and connect to my 5G also. Never mind. So uh, yeah, and then uh, it's working. So let me just try and take off my internet cable and see if it works. It does. And then uh, let's just go to a website or something. Yep, everything is working well. Yep, that's all for me, guys. Thank you for watching. Remember to like and subscribe and share my video if you find it useful. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.